Two senators, one Democrat and one Republican, plan to introduce a new gun control bill in the U.S. Senate today. Moving the age to 21 for assault weapons or those type of purchases to make it in line with what is already there for handguns. President Trump has called for that to happen, but now the White House is being more cautious about whether the president would sign the bipartisan bill. It would be premature for us to weigh in, but as I said, the president is still supportive of the concept. The president may support the concept, but the NRA does not, and that will make it very hard for Congress to clear a bill that raises the age to buy assault weapons. There are a number of things that are being looked at right now. That's not one of the ones that's being talked about as much as basically is closing loopholes. Congressman Steve Scalise, who is himself a victim of gun violence, met with students from Marjorie Stoneman Douglas High School Monday. We talked about policy, but really we talked a lot about shared experience and obviously it got very emotional, you know, some of the things that they've been through are similar to some of the things that I've been through. The Douglas students have been very vocal in their push to change gun laws since the mass shooting at their school in Parkland, Florida, almost two weeks ago. I believe they're changing the way our country thinks about this issue. The students met with Senate Minority Leader Chuck Schumer this morning. Weijia Jang, CBS News, Capitol Hill. We cannot settle for half measures.